Welcome to Bus Driver Life. My name is Kiwan. I am a bus driver in Sacramento, California. And this video is just gonna kind of be like a vlog style video. I'm pretty much on a break right now. It's a very short break and I just wanna show you the bus terminal or where my route terminates, but the route ends and begins where I'm at right now. So I'll just show you around a little bit. No, God, please, no, no! So I'm operating the Route 11, which has service from Land Park City College, which is where I am at right now. And it goes to the Natomas area of Sacramento. So as you can see, Sacramento City College, home of the Panthers. And you see my bus is parked here, but the bus stop is way up there. And there's also a light rail station over there as well. So here's the back side of my bus. As you can see, this is a CNG. Bus. It doesn't use diesel or gasoline or propane, it uses CNG. And this is a 2015 Gillick BRT bus, BRT plus bus. And here we go, as you can see, we actually have restrooms here. This is a luxury for bus drivers to have restrooms. Um, in the transit industry in general, bus drivers have to look for places to use the restroom a lot of times. There will be some places that'll be equipped with a restroom for the bus drivers, but if there was not a restroom here, what I would have to do is go all the way across this field here. See all those places over there? I would have to hope that one of those stores or restaurants would allow me, a hardworking blue collar bus driver, to use use their restroom facilities. He ain't lying. So there goes my bus. And if we turn around, you can see some more of the campus here. And the bus stop is actually way down here, way ahead of us. So here we are at the actual bus stop. There's a couple of benches here, bus stop sign right there, and some more seating over here. And a lot of times what'll happen is while we're taking our break, people that are waiting for the bus right here, they'll see the bus back there. And we park back there so that we can have a little break and the restrooms for us are down there. But people will walk all the way down there and bang on the door. And they'll pretty much ask like, hey, what time are you leaving? Can I get on the bus? What are you doing? Why are you taking a break? Who told you you deserved a break? And it can be a little irritating, but I understand people want to get on the bus. They see the bus. They don't want the bus to leave them. So that's really why a lot of times people will come up to the bus. So I do get it. So, you know. The cool thing about this bus stop is it's right by a light rail station. Check it out. Here goes the train right here. So it's very convenient for people. They can take the bus and they can take the train in the same area. And it's right by a college and there's a pedestrian bridge that you can walk across that will take you to a bunch of homes and a bunch of stores and restaurants over there. And we have another train arriving right now. So yeah, that's pretty much this end of my route. But what I'm gonna do now is show you the other end of the route when I'm in the Natomas area of Sacramento. It is completely different from this particular terminal. really nice and peaceful, isn't it? It's like you're taking a journey through nature or something. What? I don't know. Thank you so much for watching Bus Driver Life. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing and I gotta get back to work.